So you can see Showcase here, we have Field Connect, which is our new soil moisture monitoring system. Uh, we released it last year, and so this is the first full cropping cycle to utilize that. So making decisions on irrigation, making decisions on tiling, um, being able to measure that input like some of our growers have never done before. So you insert a probe into one of your soil management zones, and it is connected to a gateway. And that takes and wirelessly sends that data back to a website, fieldconnect.com, where you can access from your smartphone, your tablet, or your desktop. And it puts it into graph or different ways that you want to see that data. And you can make decisions on when you need to water, when you need to take it off, based off those. So we also have mydrondeer.com. Select there for you. And it's a landing page. So it's a single sign-on. All of our growers have multiple deer applications they use. Well, this brings it into one spot. So one username, one password. And they can access their John Deere financial accounts. My John Deere, JD Link. Um, and what this does is it brings all their data into one spot. And so what they can do today is remote display access, which enables them or their John Deere dealer to remotely view the 2630 in the cab from driving down the highway in the dealership's office, wherever that may be. So remote support has a whole new name. And also, they can look at their telematically enabled machines. So looking at JD Link information, looking at fuel efficiency, settings, changing them on the go. So we can go back home here. We also have automated crop reporting. So that's being able to use your agronomic data that you collect in the field to better streamline your governmental reporting. And using the John Deere Crop Insurance System, the automated crop reporting makes it just one click easier. So there's a lot of paperwork and a lot of hassle in terms of reporting your FSA acres and getting that. Well, now the government is accepting documentation data. And so being able to use what you're collecting already for cropping decisions, being able to use that to eliminate some of the paperwork and just have a one click to go straight to your agent. Very good. Saves a lot of time. So Machine Sync we released last year as well. That's when the combine is able to control the tractor of the green cart. So making on the go unloading that much more efficient, eliminating some of the human error and being able to continue to go in the field. We've had great reviews so far. It's, it's the first in automation. It's what we've heard from customers, you know, we still want to have somebody in the cab, but we want to eliminate some of the air that they can do. So Machine Sync is that first step. And what we heard this fall was that great reviews. Um, a lot of customers are saying, you know, what additional platforms can I put it on? So that's the next step. This was round one. You know, customers got to get used to it, but when they look at, usually you have your most experienced operator in the combine, the most, you know, important part of the day. And they're able to, once the tractor gets into that acquire zone, they can toggle them forward or backward. So when you look at how you fill your grain cart, who has the best view? The tractor driver, you know, looking over his shoulder, or the combine looking straight across. And so they're able to move them forward or backward based on that. So they're seeing a lot of good benefits there. So Mobile Farm Manager is a new iPad or Apple-based, so iPad or iPhone application where a customer can sync their Apex maps to their mobile device. So being able to take their maps from their desktop out into the field. They can also do soil grid sampling. And as we look at adding additional things on that, when you're out in the field and you want to put a flag or you want to know where a weed is or a rock, you can look at that on your mobile farm management and then sync that back into your apex when you get into the office. It's basically, you know, when you're out in the field and you're doing crop scouting or you're doing soil sampling, you want to, if you want to know, well, what yield, you know, or what, what did I do? What, did I, what rate did I plant last year? So being, bringing those maps to your fingertips, you can take your information wherever you go.